uh, now this is uh, we have time series data for all of these months we have closing price of a stock so I'm going to open this up in StatCrunch and show how you can create a time series in StatCrunch so there's a nice tool for graphing a time series what I'm going to do is choose under graph this index slash time plot um, I choose closing price to be my data that I want to graph and I want to go down I'm gonna choose time to be my my x-axis and I'm gonna choose it to go by month starting month is one which corresponds to January and the increment that's one month per bar or each data is in the next month that's what I want I'm gonna display points and lines uh, and if I hit compute it's gonna give me a very beautiful time series plot and from this I can compare to the charts that are given here and we can see that this is the chart that matches very nicely with the time series that I've created so that's the right choice here um, what let's see a discernible trend I would say that, that there's a general increase over time so it generally increased over the course of the year the percent change from January to, to December to find the percent change what we want to do is first find what was the change okay so take the January and December price difference so 37.25 that was the December price minus 28.61 8.64 that was the price difference now what I want to do is find what's that what per, per percent of the original price is that so divide it by 28.61 and let's multiply it by 100 just to put it into a percent 30.199 now I'm gonna round it to the nearest tenth so that's 30.2 percent and that's how you find the percent change